A supercapacitor, also known as a ultra capacitor or double layer capacitor, is an energy storage device that can store and release energy much more rapidly than the, than the traditional capacitors or batteries. It stores energy through the separation of positive and negative charges, typically using high surface area materials like activated carbon. This small capacitor that I'm holding in my hand is 2.7 volts 10 farads. And this one is a giant supercapacitor, 2.7 volts 3000 farads, made by Maxwell. And it's not cheap. This small supercapacitor of 10 farads is 300 times smaller that this big supercapacitor that have 3000 farads. There is a big difference. And just letting you know that these things on eBay are not cheap and you can find a bunch of copies. For example, this is two, $300 for six pieces. It's a, like a power bank this is not good you need to find a Maxwell brand come on this one it's around 50 60 dollars for one capacitor So you can charge this supercapacitor very fast and you can use a high current while charging the capacitors. Right now here I have a digital power supply that is set on 5.2 volts and they are almost fully charged and they are pulling around 1 amps and the current is dropping because the supercapacitors are fully charged. Here I have a digital multimeter to measure the voltage. Okay, 4.97 volts and each supercapacitor is 2.7 volts and when you connect in series you will get 5.4 volts and you will not any longer have uh, 3000 farads because you connect capacitors in series the capacitance drops to 1500 Farads. Okay. First, I'm gonna hook up these small bulbs and see the voltage drop. Okay, two bulbs. And the voltage is steady 4.97 volt. Six. All right. Now I'm gonna try to power this gear at wheels. We are still at 4.96 volts. And the voltage is holding. is great. Next experiment is to make a short and just to monitor the voltage. Please do not try this at home. I'm gonna short positive with negative pole of the supercapacitor and believe me this is not held for the supercapacitor but I'm gonna try it. Whoa. A lot of power. Let's try it again. The copper wire is melting over the high current that is 
inside the supercapacitor. Whoa! The voltage dropped to 4.9 volts and the wire is hot. We are still having 4.9 volts, okay? And in this video just wanted to show you what they can do this powerful supercapacitor and when they when they are connected in series you will get much more voltage. Okay. I hope you liked today's video, which was an experiment. And I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching. See you in the next time.